today uh, we shall be developing we shall be developing a short run causality model short run causality model and we have uh, you can see there are three variables one is adu gdp and inv so what is adu there are three variables one is uh, adu what is adu adu means education and then we have the second variable gdp what is gdp gross domestic product and that is gross domestic product and finally we have another variable investment that is i and investment right so we have these three variables one is education second is gross domestic product and the third is a investment so the variable is here you can see from here right the variable open as a group these are the variables education gdp and inv so the data from 1980 until 2010 so so the variable from 1980 until 2010 okay and first uh, here here in this model in this model we shall be checking the causality causa checking the causality among these among these three variables okay okay so for first i go to quick then group statistics then i choose the johansen test of co integration right and here uh, i put all the variables adu gdp and inv so i put the three variables and here and here i and here i i uh, here my assumption is here my assumption is all the variables are integrated of same order here my assumption is all these three variables are integrated of same order only then uh, uh, only then i can run the johansen test of co integration then i proceed with the okay okay suppose here i choose the i choose this one and suppose here i choose lag 2 lag 2 why because lag selection criteria is asking me to take lag 2 for this system equation lag selection criteria is asking me to take lag 2 for this system model for this is a system model so i take lag 2 suppose right suppose uh, it is lag 2 and here i take lag 3 then i proceed i click okay so this is the outcome you can see so here you can see this is our series and here we have uh, trust uh, statistics and here is maxen eigen values statistics so here okay so the first uh, the first is what trust statistics trust statistics that is the first one statistics okay 
and here it is right and it is the null null hypothesis here it is the null hypothesis right that is none what does mean by none none means here none means there is there is no quantic ration equation right that is the null hypothesis there is no co-integration uh, co model, right? That is none. So here, here you can see that test statistics is 26.38 and critical value is 29.79, meaning that test statistics is less than critical value, meaning that we cannot reject null hypothesis, meaning that there is no co-integration model. So, and also meaning that all the variables are not co-integrated. And also here, the P of the probability value, how much the probability value the p value is here is 11.75 uh, percent 75 percent meaning that more than five percent so we cannot reject null hypothesis because the p value is more than five percent meaning that there is no co-integration among the variables meaning that meaning that there is no long run association ship among three variables meaning that meaning that there there is no long run causality among the variables so meaning that there is no long run causality among the variables meaning that there is only short run causality meaning that in this model in this model in this model there is only short run causality among variables right there is only short run causality but no long run causality okay it is done this thing is done then we talk about the second one so also uh, the result is given here the test test indicates no co-integration model right no co-integration model okay the, the, then the second one is maximum eigenvalue statistics maximum eigenvalue test all right and here so uh, so first i talk about the null hypothesis what is the null hypothesis none none the null hypothesis and here the max eigen statistics is less than critical value so meaning that uh, meaning that there is no long run association ship among the variables and the probability value thirty three point six one percent meaning that we cannot reject null hypothesis and what is our null hypothesis that is none meaning that there is no co-integration uh, uh, model right 
that means there is no long run association ship among the variables and the result is also given here max eigen value test indicates no cointegration so meaning that so according to according to max maximum eigen value test and trace statistics indicates indicates that variables are not cointegrated meaning that there is no long run causality there is no long run causality among the variables so there is only short run causality among variables because the variables are not cointegrated because the variables are not cointegrated 